Sweeping the country, waves are hugging the shore. All the sexes from Maine to Texas have never known such love before. See them billing and cooing like the birdies above. Each girl and boy alike sharing joy alike. Feels that passion will soon be national. Love is sweeping the country. There never was so much love. Girl and boy alike sharing joy alike. The country. Sweeping the country. Love is sweeping the country. Sweeping the country.
morning, everybody. Welcome. It's lovely to see you here. When Paul Porter wrote, So in Love, he might well have been expressing how many of us feel about Broadway musicals, and in particular, how we feel about the love songs. Similarly, in writing, music is better than words, the lyricists Betty Comden and Adolph Green might have been describing what our illustrious array of talent has in store for you this evening. Music is better than words. Let me see, it goes, music is better than words, you break the spell when you start to speak. That technique is all wrong. Just forget about words and sing her a song. When you're without words, you cry and your song is the blues. But when you got love, you're high and your song is a gay refrain, a happy strain that sings out the news. So why don't I take their advice and not waste any more of your time talking and let the music speak. <laughs> Come on along and listen to the lullaby of Broadway, the hip ray and valley, the lullaby of Broadway, the rumble of the subway trains, the rattle of the taxis, the daffodils who entertain at Angelo's and Maxie's. When a Broadway baby says goodnight, it's early in the morning. Broadway babies don't sleep tight until the dawn. Good night, baby. Good night. Milkman's on his way. Baby goes home to her flat to sleep all day.
you can bet that he's doing it for some dog. For some dog. Call it sad, call it funny, but it's better than even money. That the guys on So you're all the time right, and I'm all the time wrong. So my character's weak, and your character's strong. So your brow is so high, and my brow is so low. Well, brow now I'm close to you now. And all I can tell you is, oh, go suit me, suit me. What can you do me? I love you. Love you. Give a holler and hate me, hate me. Go ahead, hate me. I love you. All right, already I'm just a no good Nick. All right, already it's true, so new. So sue me, sue, sue, me, sue me, me, what can you do me? I love you. Serve a paper and sue me, sue me, what can you do me? I love you. Give a holler and hate me, hate me. Go ahead. Hate me. All right, already I'm strictly a kind of go call a policeman. I don't know why they even had that police man over here playing last night. These men kids in my neighborhood are nice. All right, already it's true, too true. So sue me, sue me. What can you do me? I love, I love, I love, I love you. He put his hand near mine and then he touched me. I felt a sudden tingle when he touched me. A sparkle, a glow. He knew it. It was an accidental no. He knew it. He seemed and smiled to tell me so all through it. He knew it. I know. Misery. 
Such a wonderful drive towards Valentine. He touched me. I simply have to face the fact he touched me. Control myself and try to act as if I. Sempre misero, chi ha le saffira, chi le confira, mal cauto il core, ormai non sente si felici a pieno, chi sul quel seno non limba more, la donna immobile qua di un mal vento, muta dal cielo. Thank you. 
Breakfast with her bib, with her baby teeth and all her baby hairs. She's a tot, just a tot. Good for bouncing on your knee. I am positive that she doesn't even know that boys are a girl. She's a snip, just a snip. Making dreadful baby noise, having fun with all her toys. Just a chickadee who needs her mother hand. She's a tough and a deuce. You can never turn her loose. She's too infantile to take her from her pen. Of course. That we can intervene, in spite of all her youthful thrill. She was exceedingly polite, and on the whole, a sheer delight. And if it wasn't joy galore, at least not once was she a bore, that I recall. No, not at all. Ah! She's a child, a silly child. Had a lesson to her toes, and good heaven, how it shows. Sticky thumbs are all the fingers she has got. She's a child, a clumsy child. She's as swollen as a grape, and she doesn't have a shape. Where her figure ought to be, it is not. Just a child, a growing child. But so backward for her years, if a boy her age appears, well, I'm certain he would never call again. She's a scamp and a brat, doesn't know where she is at, unequipped and undesirable to men. 